the sun is shining i have lathered myself all with sunscreen and let's get into this video because we got a heat wave in london and it looks like a heat wave with the royal family hey guys it's morale morale hopefully you guys are all doing well today back again with another video if you have not subscribed click that button guys it is daily and consistent content comment down below and let's get into this royal nugget video and discuss what is going on with our favorite cherished loved royals that we love so much because we love this monarchy now Pippa Middleton has been tipped guys for the role in reconciliation between the Sussexes and Princess Kate GB News is reporting that Pippa Middleton has been tipped for a role between and she is going to help them you know come back together again now the jokes write themselves because what is Pippa going to do she's barely around Kate as it is let alone William and she's never really around Harry and Meghan so for some reason she is going to be the spokesperson and you know reconcile these two parties I'm not buying it I think it's just some fodder and fake news because it doesn't make any sense to me as to how that you know works please somebody let me know why Pippa of all people is going to be helping uh, I'm confused not only that but Kate Middleton is reported to have been feared uh, being overshadowed by Diana before inheriting her life she considered refusing the title of Princess of Wales because she feared the comparisons with the late Princess Diana this new book is revealing. Now, this new book is a headache for Kate because it's the last thing that she wants that, you know, a book is coming out about her um, with everything that she's going through. You know, you don't want something like this to happen. I can imagine these comparisons because Diana would overshadow a lot of royals. She was that girl and I can see why this would be the case. Now, speaking of Meghan and Kate, it's been revealed that Kate Middleton and William actually wanted tougher statements to slap down Meghan Markle's racist claims. William and Kate were insistent on releasing a tougher statement in order to slap down Meghan's claims, royal experts have said. Three years on from that Meghan and Harry interview with Oprah, it has been claimed that William and Kate insisted on releasing a harsher statement in response to the racism allegations made by the couple. The interview divided opinion on Meghan and Harry, with some celebrating and others, you know, saying that it's treason. In the weeks that followed, many labelled the British monarchy racist, with the royal family coming out swinging and defending itself. In an unprecedented statement released on behalf of the late Queen, the royal family said that the issues raised, particularly that of race, are concerning. And, you know, it was Kate's idea to say collections may vary. They are taken very seriously and will be addressed by the family privately. So it was actually Kate Middleton who came up with the powerful phrase recollections may vary it's now been revealed her husband also challenged the allegations by saying that we are very much not a racist family as well so to me it's always interesting how people are more worried about the label of being called a racist as opposed to actually the feelings of what that does to people who feel like it's racist that is what i find to be interesting but lo and behold it was kate middleton who slapped down those claims it was kate middleton who said you know what let's go back to the drawing board let's give a harsher statement because we're not having this so i can imagine that she would have gone with a harsher harsher response with Omid Scobie's book and Pierce Morgan basically exposing that it was her questioning the baby's skin color and therefore decided to do a whole new plan and bravado where she returned to Wimbledon with a standing ovation and now now that theory sounds plausible to me before it was quite far-fetched you see but now it seems quite plausible to me because you were the one to clamp down and stamp down on these statements and you know so let's go harsher let's do more and you know since Piers Morgan was saying stuff about you you obviously wanted to have I don't know disappear for a while I don't know but it's just a theory it sounds a bit outlandish but you know it doesn't sound as outlandish now that it's been revealed so it looks like these royal experts and this book coming out about Kate is the last thing that she needs because for her to be dumped on the phone call by William then had to win William back with a nurse outfit and she was bummed and really upset because he was chasing other women is something that is quite sad and William has probably been chasing multiple women since then to now you know I don't think that he suddenly stopped after Isabella and it just goes to show you that a leopard does not change its spots and William is going to continue to do stuff like this in the later years of his life it probably has been anyways unbeknownst to us or beknownst to us but let me know your thoughts are when it comes to this royal collection of kate stories that are hitting the press today and are clamping down on megan clearly you know things weren't great at that time but maybe things have you know iced out between them two 
Um, maybe the ice is thawed and melted between Kate and Megan in some kind of way where they can be cordial with each other. Subscribe or comment down below and give this video a thumbs up. I would appreciate it. It's just one click to subscribe. Please do so, guys. And I'll catch you guys soon for another video.